Welcome to the final matchup of round two in the CCSL. Today's match is with Pikachu at Lucas. And Pikachu making very quick work of Lucas, mainly due to his speed advantage is what I'm noticing so far. Lucas equalizing on the stock percentage with that up smash and then the up aerial, and recovering some health off of Pikachu's spark. which is uh, some of the unrelinquished tech that Lucas has an advantage in this uh, matchup. Pikachu now finding himself on a little bit of a disadvantage as Lucas has gotten reads on a lot of Pikachu's capabilities relatively early on. Pikachu at 125% does make it back to the stage and narrowly avoids the up smash from Lucas there. Lucas regaining health back pretty consistently with that uh, magnet on his down B. Pikachu has no such method of recovering health, so he's got to be very careful, especially when Lucas is throwing out those up smashes. Unable to connect on the Skull Bash, and Lucas takes advantage of the end lag to dispatch a Pikachu's first stock there. Pikachu racking up a little more damage with the Nair. Skull Bash could end Lucas's first stock, but Pikachu just needs to find an opportunity to connect more than anything else. The up tilt not going to be enough, despite Lucas being at the danger percent. Pikachu's got to find a decent smash attack to connect on in order to equalize the matchup here. May have been an excellent opportunity for Pikachu to use the Skull Bash there, but does not capitalize on it. And instead finds himself racking up even more damage from Lucas's upwards recovery. And the back throw is finally going to get rid of Lucas's first stock, but Pikachu finding himself at a very scary disadvantage, especially in the percent wise here. Lucas tends to throw out his up smashes a little bit more of a taunt than a viable kill option. And as I say that, he finally gets one to connect, giving him the advantage. And regaining some of his health off of Pikachu's jolts. Pikachu finally connecting on a forward smash, followed up with a Nair. Putting Lucas back up to 75, now 80%. but still having some issues actually dispatching of Lucas's stocks. Pikachu rolls back behind Lucas to avoid the PK fire, gets caught again with the up smash. Nice parry of the PK fire there. Pikachu needs to find another opportunity to actually dispatch of Lucas's second stock here. The up B is not going to be that opportunity, though, I'll tell you that much. And with the dash attack, that's actually going to equalize, bringing us to the final stock. Pikachu needing to make up some very desperate ground to stay competitive in this matchup. And that does not seem to be the case so far. Lucas making excellent use of his magnet to regain health off of Pikachu's Jolt Attack. So we've seen him do that four or five times in this matchup alone. And that might be it for Lucas as, nope, he does make his way back onto the stage. And Pikachu also making his way back onto the stage. Both combatants nearing or at the 100% mark. And the PK Thunder tails Pikachu off the right side of the stage, giving Lucas the victory here. Lucas wins. Huh? 
don't act so surprised, Lucas. You knew what you were doing there. Well-earned victory. So that brings us to the end of our round two matchups. Uh, we will not be taking a break, and we'll be back in two days' time in order to be back for the first matchup of round three. But you're going to have to tune in then to see who it's going to be. Until then, thanks for tuning in, and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date.